off the rush. Get it wide, attack the quadrant, the cycle, water high, shoot off the pass, net front, F1 goes to the first post, looking for the rebound. Ready? Red, red, white, white, here we go. Hey, get in the net, hey, focus on those little black things you're supposed to stop. Don't be as scared of them. I think I played my first game when I was about four. Started skating when I was uh, about two and a half to three. And uh, I have an older brother who I always looked up to that, uh, you know, he was always playing hockey and I always wanted to be like him and play hockey. And uh, so I would say hockey's kind of been uh, the uh, big picture of my life, I guess, since, you know, being a young kid. You know, I come, come to the rink every day and uh, try to enjoy it as much as I can because I know that, uh, you know, once you lose it, once you're done hockey, you can never have that, the opportunity to, you know, be in the locker room with the guys or go out to dinner with the guys or, you know, that's something that you'll miss. So I try to, you know, make every day count. It's just been something that uh, I've fallen in love with and uh, it's, it's something that, you know, I've dreamed of doing my whole life and I just still be able to do it is obviously great. Attack the question. You. This is how I play a five on three. Yep. And Matt's had a great influence in our room. He's very, very good. I think he's got a good way about him. He's a guy that can play in any, any situation. Great leader, and Matt brings a tremendous amount of different intangibles and tangibles to our team. Good, Matt's been a, he's been a great guy in our locker room. He's came in here, he's been great to all the younger guys, and, and he's a guy in the locker room that, that we count on kind of to play in all situations. Matt has been a really good presence in our room, and he's got a really good demeanor. You know, there's not one guy in the locker room I wouldn't invite to uh, come over to my house and have dinner. You know, every guy, everyone in that locker room is, uh, you know, you respect, uh, you know, there's guys that are, you know, just 20 years old, they're 12 years, 13 years younger than me, and uh, it's a good group of guys that when you go on the road, you have fun, and you, you know, you can hang out with any any one of them. You know, Matt's, he's a, he's a proven goal scorer at the, at the highest level, so um, I just try to grab some things from him when I can and, and learn, uh, learn little tips like that and just working on some puck on the net. If you can have a uh, positive influence on some young kids that, uh, you know, if they're struggling or they're, they need a little guidance or something, it's just uh, to give them their, my two cents and, you know, make them feel better. And hopefully what, what I can do, you know, ultimately uh, allows them to perform better for our team. Yeah, it's huge. I think for our team, it's very important. I think we've got a really close group in here. Um, I think that kind of is indicative to our success this far. I went to school for uh, kinesiology and uh, I always thought I would use that to, you know, train hockey players or do something on the lines of hockey and uh, I'm getting uh, to a point where I got to think of a second career after hockey and I still have no clue what I want to do. You no, know, I still want to do something along, along the game and, uh, you know, be able to coach kids or, you know, uh, coach uh, my daughter or, you know, do something on the lines of still being in the hockey game as uh, obviously in the future, hopefully. I, I couldn't see myself doing anything else. I like being one of the first ones here and hang out with the guys and, you know, one of the last ones to leave. Again, every day is, uh, it's a thrill to come to the rink and, you know, be able to play hockey still. And again, with the group of guys that we have, it's, uh, it makes it a lot better.